Hey everybody, welcome back. This is Dinah Rose. So I have been re-watching um, season three in preparation for the upcoming season. And the more I watch it, the more I completely feel robbed. Carlos King didn't take care of business at all with Tisha and Marceau. I mean, they were giving us gems all season and he didn't ask one question. And the only question actually we did get about them was, why were you so upset that he took Melody Wine? Now, when Miss Wanda came over to uh, Tisha's house during this scene, um, the first thing that happened when Marceau goes out is he hugs her, he gives her this half hug. And then she said, that's okay, I'm not Melody. I don't get a full hug like Melody. Now, Tisha was trying to make it out like she wasn't jealous of Melody. In fact, Tisha went through this whole diatribe about, I'm a very secure woman. Ain't nobody gonna make me feel insecure. I know what I got at home. Well, if that's the case, why are you pulling this man's face like he's a damn three-year-old kid? It was just wild, but that entire thing felt uncomfortable. It was the first time we actually saw Tisha um, stand up to Marceau in a way that says she had a problem problem and didn't like slink off and start, you know, crying immediately. She did slink off and cry, but it wasn't immediately. So after watching the scene, I realized that the answer they gave at the reunion for why he was upset about bringing wine to Melody, it was complete BS. Miss Wanda had implied that Marceau bringing the wine over to Melody was inappropriate and tried to jump him when they were at Black. She did it again when she brought um, when she came to the house to talk to Tisha. Tisha made it seem like there was something going on when she yanked up Marceau's face and Martel made it seem like something was going on when after having an affair and his wife finding out about it, he told Marceau it was inappropriate for him to have offered Melody drinks because she was vulnerable. And then Tisha started parroting, when did he offer her drinks? When did he offer her drinks? Like that immediately pissed her off. So what is Marceau slanging over there that has everybody uncomfortable? Even Marceau asked um, Tisha, do you think I'm going to Portia Melody? I mean, he brought in Portia Williams like, you think I'm dating the castmates now? Now, I'm not going to lie. There were times in the show where Melody would walk into a room and Marceau's whole face would light up, honestly. I mean, the time he was at Jalen's um, graduation party, when Melody walked in, Marceau like perked all the way up. When Melody goes and visits him at his office or something, um, they like have this little playful banter back and forth. But that man looks happy, like happy, like in a way you haven't ever seen him with Tisha. So I guess the cast and viewers were able to sense and see things that not even Melody and Marceau were able to admit. But definitely there was more there. And I wish that Carlos would have asked more questions just altogether more questions because as you know we never got what happened in vegas we never got you know why she flipped out at the um black opening in i forgot what city that was houston and marceau made a lot of threats in season three if tisha doesn't know me by now she'll never know me this marriage is doomed all that mess we deserve some answers but let's see if we get a continuation of what happened in season three or if they do a little nice package. Because at the end of this show, they try to act like they went to a marriage counselor or they went to a financial counselor and um, they were trying to push it off as it being a financial situation. We all know that was bull, but I'd like to know what you guys think. Um, do y'all believe that Melody and Marceau had a thing? Or do you think that Marceau is just attracted to Melody? Melody said that Marceau has never done anything out of the way, nothing inappropriate, nothing that would make her think anything. Tisha was drinking that all up during the season three reunion, but was everybody buying it is the question. So you let me know what y'all think. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you on the next one.